Soldiers of the invading Russian army have shot own fellow soldiers from another military unit in Okratino settlement near the city of Avdiivka in Ukraine's Donetsk region. The incident occurred as Russian invaders mistook their fellow soldiers for the soldiers of the Russian Volunteer Corps fighting within the Ukrainian army. The incident that took place on April 7 was publicized by relatives of the killed servicemen, after which the report was circulated on Telegram channels. Entering the position, Russian soldiers immediately opened fire without clarifying the identity of the soldiers standing in front of them. Then they took pictures of the killed soldiers, describing them as enemies. The review of the documents belonging to the soldiers revealed that those killed were soldiers of the Russian army. The Israeli Air Force launched rocket attacks on the positions of the terrorist organization Hezbollah in the south of Lebanon. According to information, dozens of objects were targeted at the same time. These are the main targets in Ada Ash Shab, Ramii, and Jebel Balat. Before this, the Lebanese group Hezbollah said it launched drone attacks on Israeli bases north of the city of Acre in retaliation for the killing of one of its fighters, marking the deepest attack into Israeli territory since the Gaza War began. Hezbollah launched a combined air attack using decoy and explosive drones that targeted two Israeli bases halfway between Acre and Nahariya, it said in a statement. The Israeli military said it had no knowledge of any of its facilities being hit by Hezbollah, but had said earlier that it intercepted two aerial targets off Israel's northern coast. In retaliation, the Israeli military targeted areas in Ada Ash Shab, Blida, and near Markaba in southern Lebanon with airstrikes. Both sides have exchanged missile fire and airstrikes regularly since the conflict in Gaza began last October, carefully avoiding escalation to full scale war. However, ongoing strikes have heightened concerns that a mishap or miscalculation could quickly intensify the conflict, potentially drawing in regional and global powers, including the United States. Era de qué?